The Ink of Devotion Once upon a time, in a busy city called Damascus, there lived a girl named Ella. She had something special about her, a mark on one of her eyebrows. She got this mark when she was a child, and it made her feel different. Whenever she accidentally saw a reflection of herself in windows or mirrors, she would quickly turn away. To her, the mark looked bigger than it really was. She didn't like looking at herself in mirrors at all. As Ella grew up, she started spending more time alone in her garden, but she was always friendly and kind to everyone she met. One day, a rich young man named Jamal came to visit Ella's neighbours in the house next door. Jamal loved adventure and climbing trees. While he was up in a tree, he saw Ella in her garden. There was a wall between them, but he could still see her. She was busy doing some beautiful embroidery and humming a sweet tune. Jamal was so amazed by her grace and her lovely voice that he nearly fell out of the tree. By chance, Ella was sitting with her friend, facing in Jamal's direction. This made Jamal believe that she was the one for him. Jamal quickly climbed down from the tree and told his parents, I've found the person I want to marry. Let's call the matchmaker right away. The matchmaker came, and they talked about many things like gifts and plans for the wedding. Then, the matchmaker asked everyone to leave the room, saying, I need to talk to the young man alone. Please give us a few minutes. The matchmaker spoke to Jamal with seriousness. You know, this young woman is from a good family, and she's as graceful as a princess. But there's something about her that you should know. A flaw. Jamal interrupted her, saying, I've seen her myself, and I don't want to hear about any flaws. So, the preparations for the wedding began. The special day arrived, and Ella's garden was filled with fresh flowers from the walls to the tops of the trees. But as Ella stood there in her beautiful wedding clothes, she felt worried. Just before the ceremony started, she turned to her mother and asked, Are you sure the matchmaker told Jamal about my eyebrow? I'm not sure he knows. Her mother reassured her while adjusting her veil. Yes, my dear, I've told him many times. He knows about your eyebrow and it doesn't bother him at all. Still, Ella couldn't help but worry. She watched Jamal as he laughed and talked with the guests. She wondered why he didn't try to sneak a look at her, to see the mark hidden under her veil. She couldn't understand why he seemed unaware of it. After the wedding ceremony, when they were finally alone, Jamal gently lifted Ella's veil. He was surprised when he saw her eyebrow, and Ella noticed the surprise on his face. So, Ella spoke up. My dear husband, didn't the matchmaker tell you about my imperfect eyebrow? Jamal remained silent, and Ella continued. She told him the story of how she got the scar when she was a little girl, playing in a garden far away. A little boy accidentally threw a heavy stone that hit her forehead and left the mark. Ella apologised, saying, I'm sorry that I can't be perfect for you, my husband. Finally, Jamal spoke. Do you remember the name of that little boy who threw the stone? Ella sadly replied, I'm afraid I don't know. He was just a guest there, like me. But then Jamal whispered, Was the garden where you were playing owned by the Mansour family in the city of Aleppo? Ella was surprised and asked, How did you know that? Jamal confessed, Because I was that boy. My parents told me the story of how I accidentally hurt a little girl in the Mansour family's garden. It seems fate brought us together in marriage, giving me a chance to make up for the harm I caused. Now, I know what I must do. Jamal called for the best black ink and a very thin brush. With great care, he drew a new eyebrow over the scar. 
This new eyebrow was so delicate and curved, it looked just like Ella's other perfect eyebrow. No one could tell the difference. For many happy years, the two of them lived together. Every morning, Jamal would paint a new graceful eyebrow over the scar he had caused. This act of love continued, and they both lived their lives in complete happiness. True love goes beyond physical imperfections. The story emphasises the importance of understanding, acceptance and the willingness to make amends for past mistakes in a relationship. Genuine love involves embracing each other's flaws and working together to overcome challenges for a deeper and lasting bond.